Hello and welcome. Today's tutorial I'm going to show you how to improve the sound quality of a poor microphone. To do this you need a program installed on your computer called Nero Wave Editor. If you've been following this series of tutorials you will have already installed Nero Platinum 15. And I'm going to click that icon on my desktop and I'm brought into this screen. If you head to the bottom of the screen where it says Tools and Settings and click, you're brought to this screen. Now this is the icon for Nero Wave Editor. Mine is coloured purple. If yours is grey like this icon, it means that you haven't downloaded and installed that particular program. I'm going to show you where this download takes you by clicking on this icon and I'm brought to the Nero website where if you scroll down eventually you'll end up at this part of the screen where it says Nero Wave Editor and by clicking on the download link you would be able to follow a wizard that would allow you to install this program. I'm going to exit from this website because I already have this installed and I'm going to click and I'm brought into this screen. Now in this screen I am going to go to the record button and if I press that button it gives me the option of the quality that I want to choose and I like high quality so I'm going to choose the highest quality that I can on these two drop downs and I'm going to click OK and this is the scale of volume that you can see on the, the right of the uh, screen and if I come across to the red button and click on the red button I would start recording and in time honoured fashion I'm going to click and I'm going to say testing one two testing one two three and then I click and that's finished the recording if I click on OK I can now see the recording on the screen and as you can notice in this section here and at the end of the recording there's a lot of white noise and if I play this recording you'll hear that noise so I come to the top of the screen where it says play section and I'm going to say testing one two testing one two three and as you can hear there is a considerable amount of white noise on this recording that's because the microphone I'm using is of a poor quality. So I want to improve that recording. So I come to this symbol and I click and that selects a whole of the recording. I go to enhancement and I click on the drop down. I look for noise analyst. It tells me that it successfully analysed this track. I click OK. I go back to enhancement, I look for noise reduction and I click and I'm brought into this screen. I can now play that recording and I can use these two slide settings to adjust the white noise balance. And I'm going to say testing one, two, testing one, two, three. And I'm going to say testing one, two, testing one, two, three. And by clicking on the OK, I've now set that recording uh, so that I can now play. I'm going to the top middle where it says play. I'm clicking. And I'm going to say testing one, two, testing one, two, three. And as you can tell, the white noise has been dramatically reduced, which I think 
it has improved this track and it's improved the quality of the recording from this mic. So I need to put that into a file and to do that I can click file, I can save as, I'm going to look to see what I want to save this file as. At the moment it's as a WAV file. I could choose what type of file I wanted it to be saved as. I'm happy with it being saved as that format. I give it a name, which is test. It's going to save this in my D drive. I'm going to click save. And if I then close this screen, go into my file manager, go to D drive, look for test, which is a WAV file. I'm going to click that file and it will play. And I'm going to say testing one, two, testing one, two, three. And there we have it. We've changed the quality of the recording from being quite poor to being very good. I hope that you've enjoyed this short tutorial. There's far more to Wave Editor, but to start with, it's a good way of finding your way around this program just by doing this simple exercise. I hope you've enjoyed this video and I look forward to talking to you next time. Thanks for watching.